Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to some Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood today. We are on episode 7. It is called Hidden Truths. Last episode was a bit of a chill episode, and I believe one of the comments, uh, who was it? Uh, Nick Anderson said, this is your wholesome resting episode. It's pretty much full throttle from here on. I liked the development with Mr. Armstrong. He's such a wholesome character and can you blame me though so we're gonna get right into it all right a little bit of a recap of last episode possession of an incomplete philosopher's stone and it's not one state too it'd be liquidy esque he and al immediately left for the first branch of the national central library did his stretches with metal marco's research into the secrets of the philosopher's stone still she pulled a like three all like all-nighters that's kind of insane Oof. It's storming so loud. I don't know if you guys can hear. Oh, is that what you were doing in Central? Ah. Yes. Uh, the full metal boy found out about Marco's research. It was Something Lust. Done about it. So Lust, Gluttony, and who's the third? Care of. Of progressing in East City. Just lurking. I smell him. I can smell him. What kind of smell is that? He's just fallen. He's close. Oh. Like you can smell his volans. I still get to eat him right down to the last strand of hair. So she's still looking for the Elrics, but I, her methods or her reasoning is so bizarre to me because it's still kind of unclear. Oh, yeah, they are looking for Scar. Okay. They, they said the Ishvalden blood. Do the rashes follow? Dude! Oh my gosh, she's just rushing at him. Okay, how strong is Gluttony, though? Yeah, I was about to say, Scar is kind of insane. Ripped his arm off. Oh shoot! That was creepy. Not once since that incident with the Elric brothers. Guys, look outside. Maybe he's not even in East City anymore. I hope you're wrong about that. Uh. This case has obviously gotten to be too much for Central to handle. I like how he's just chilling in the sewers. I'll be golden. My stock will go up. I've got a ladder to climb. I need every mark in my favor that I can get. At least until I've assumed the office of Fuhrer. Oh, so he wants to be Fuhrer. You may so They're about to know. I'll be sure to remember that in the future. About what's going on. Reporting in, sir. Word of an explosion occurring on the Marl River. Get out there. What? Oh, man. This this did just go zero to 100 real quick. Everything else that's been going on around here. Who knows? I mean, where did they go? <gasps> His jacket. There's no mistaking it. This was definitely Scar's jacket. But who's Have doing? Found the body? Not yet, but we're still searching. Uh, they don't know about lust and gluttony. Yeah. What a Fuhrer would do. Day and night to clear out this debris. No It'll assumptions. So much as a coffee break until that's done. Do you understand? Not even all the townspeople are just. <laughs> Shut up. <gasps> Gluttony's in the crowd. I've seen his body, and that means you don't get to either. I think that was him, right? Get to work, then. Yeah, there he is. <laughs> I didn't get my snack. Is anybody listening to this conversation? Oh, father. Hmm. So they know they didn't kill Scar. Left here but ashes. You have been ordered to report back to the command center, sir. We'll be taking over supervision of Edward Elric and his brother effective immediately. Why? I guess because Armstrong's so important. What is this? Just when I think I'm home free, they saddle me with more bodyguards? <laughs> is it because he's so young that he needs bodyguards? Oh, I guess because he's so important and scars after them. Something wrong? Oh, he's it's intimidated. Nothing. Although, if you don't mind me asking, why are you wearing a suit of armor? <laughs> well, it's a hobby. A hobby? What kind of freak? Can't really explain is? that. It's weird how not everyone knows their story. I guess because it's taboo to try and do that kind of thing. Good thing he reads quickly. That's pretty tidy. Gosh, where is she? Is she buried under the books? Oh my gosh! Don't destroy the books! So they moved all the books there and they're gonna have to try and find that specific book in the mountain of books. Supposed to be working and all I ever did was read. Fired me. If I don't find another job, I'll never be able to move my poor elderly mother into a better hospital. Top ten status anime backstories. The only thing I can do well is read. I'll never find another job. Not a bad trait to be obsessed with reading, honestly. Do you remember seeing any research belonging to someone named Tim Marco? Let's see, Tim Marco. Where Do you have it memorized? Oh, yes, of course. I remember 
remember now? There were some handwritten notes stuffed into a bookcase where they didn't belong. She knows exactly what they're talking about. Which means they burned up along with everything else in the library. Unless they moved it over. Is that why you're asking? But it's too late now. They're nothing but No, she knows where they are. I remember everything that was in them. Would that help at all? How? It's just how I am. I'm able to remember. What kind of brain you got, lady? I could write them out for you. Oh my gosh. You're my hero. <laughs> Ow. Dude, what kind of complete copies of all Tim Marco's notes? That's literally inhuman. I know five days is a Actually inhuman. There are some amazing people in Protect her at all costs. Written by Tim Marco. One thousand easy recipes. Uh, unless that has something to do with it. All this way for a cookbook? Is it not what you're looking for? All I do is I remember. Kind of a code, maybe. Well, absolutely sure this is a flawless reproduction of the notes. Oh yes, I'm one hundred. It's just hidden within the recipes. Then thank you very much. Interesting. Hmm. Kind of like a treasure the hunt. There. I almost forgot Jessica's fee. I was about to say you're gonna pay her, right? This is my registration number and the pocket watch for ID. Withdraw huh? that amount from my annual research grants and make sure Sheska gets it, okay? Oh. I mean, I hey, if you got money to spend. Just take this note down to the state alchemist office. That should work. This is priority well, number one. Sheska, you're a lifesaver. Bye. I always love how Al looks in the background. <laughs> how much? There's a decimal point somewhere. How does a boy like that have this kind of money to throw around? The flex, bro. He's just balling and can just spend that kind of money. What could they possibly have to do with Because yeah, it's recipes, it's specific amounts. Incredibly dangerous if misused. Mm. In order to prevent that, alchemic research encrypted. is always encrypted. These are designed to look like recipes to the average person. I kind of figured it out. Actually advanced yeah, because if someone had just stumbled upon oh, them, that would have been originally wrote them can understand. Like you said, dangerous. They're so heavily encrypted, then how are you going to be able to decipher them? We'll have to use all our alchemical knowledge. That's a lot of notes, too. That sounds really complicated. There's a section in here on green tea. Green tea? Are you thinking what I am? Uh-huh. Is green tea important? To the green lion of metallurgic alchemy. It's ah, yes. Concerning the Philosopher's Stone? I was going to say the exact same thing. And maybe here, too. Great. He's like, what are these guy. kids? Do this. Why does this encryption have to be so damn hard to figure out? Really? Oh my gosh. Maybe we should ask Dr. Marco about this directly. Is Dr. Marco even alive from Lust? Because she she encountered him, didn't she? We don't even know what happened. I was able to move my mother to a better hospital. Uh -oh. I really appreciate it. Oh, maybe yeah, she'll help. No big deal, really. Major Armstrong told me you two were here. What gives, Ed? I told you to give me a shout the next time you made it to Central. Something <laughs> came up. I like how <laughs> he just wants to be friends. Just how high up are these boys? <laughs> <laughs> We've had a lot of cases to deal with lately, and we're still working on even the higher ups. They just like they know how powerful. Sorry, I guess that brings up some unpleasant memories. The huh? Tucker Camaras. Yeah, I wouldn't bring it up in front of As Ed. Things weren't bad enough for us already. First branch had to burn down in the middle of all this. That's been a problem, huh? All our case records were stored in the stacks at that location. Just ask, to ask her to remake them. Yeah, I was about to say she can literally redo all of them. Lieutenant Colonel, I think I've got exactly the person. Yeah, she can make a living doing that, bro. I can't believe she's looking for a job. You're hired. Thanks so much. I'll have faith just like you told me to. Thank you. Thank you. Dragging her to work. Oh, he's got her a job. Dedication is a talent all on its own. Concentration too. Very smooth, little brother. Very smooth. Do you know how hard it is well, to pay attention to something? I always think whenever I see a certain someone I know. That's cute. I mean, yeah, we've seen Ed. Someone should hurry and get back to work. Or you're gonna have to come up with a new motivational phrase. Like read a whole book in one sitting before. That surprises me that he's not able to concentrate on something like this. This is important. <laughs> That's how it be, dude, after long sessions. I mean, Al doesn't even have to sleep. How do you even, like, know if something is a formula? Or not? I guess they, they know a lot of alchemy, so they would recognize it. I'm awake. I'm awake. The library's closing. They've been at it for 10 days now. 10 days? To hell with it! To hell with it! <laughs> oh my gosh. Don't get angry because you can't crack it. Throwing things won't help. We did crack it. Huh? Oh. We cracked the code and decrypted the notes. But that's a good thing, isn't it? There's nothing good about this. It's like impossible it. to recreate, probably. This is the devil's research. Dr. Marco is right. It's evil. Oh, shoot. What's so evil about it? The main ingredient for a philosopher's stone 
is human life. Oh my goodness. To manufacture even a single stone, you have to make multiple human sacrifices. The duality. The military authorized research into something so horrible. Don't speak to anyone about this. Well, because nothing equals but a human sir, life. Please. So it's that Just power. Pretend you never heard any of it. That's why it's so powerful. Now he's realizing there's no hope because they're not going to sacrifice What's people for their own doing the elric brothers are holed up in their room again it disturbs me too just thinking about it i bet i'd act the same way what was that <gasps> oh it i'm was sure armstrong sad. would be fine learning about it is most suspicious. <laughs> <laughs> oh that sucks though There's like no hope for them getting a philosopher's stone to eat. we try so hard to grasp the truth but it always slips away they have to find one already made, if possible. It turns out the truth is too dangerous to hold. I feel like that's the only option, because like I said, they're not going to sacrifice anyone themselves. God's special way of torturing people who've committed taboos. Making the choose to sacrifice wonder, more. If it'll be like this all our lives, there's something I've been wanting to tell you for a while. I. Brothers, I know you're in there. Wait, what? What do we do? We ignore him. See, like Alice Braun like that again. I know what it said, Edward Elric. See, I knew they would tell Arm. Like, it'd be fine if Armstrong knew. Quiet when someone like him asks you. It's true. He's doing the finger tap. Often the truth is more cruel than we bargained for. The truth. I mean, he already had a general idea what they were researching. Go sit at the station. Maybe you'll find the truth hidden within the truth. Maybe that it's a lie. Have a clue what he was talking about then, but you can see. It's right in front of him. Only a portion of the truth. There's still more to find here. It's more than just sacrifices, I guess. Currently, there are four operational alchemy laboratories in Central. Marco worked in the third laboratory. None were doing any remarkable research. Uh, I'm wondering... Here, what's this building used for? It was designed for the fifth laboratory, but it isn't currently in use. If the it's... building isn't structurally sound, so it's been classified off limits. It's there. What's There's it? There's a prison right next door. What was the main ingredient for a philosopher's stone? You said it needed the used humans. prisoners. Oh. Damn criminals in the prison. Oh. Initially, they'd be recorded as executed. Huh. They're using the prisoners to make the stone. Don't look at me like that. Maybe it's like replicable. More than you. If you already have a stone. I hmm. wonder if the government is involved. It's all corrupted. I feeling that we're getting involved in something really dangerous. That's why we told you to pretend like you'd never heard anything. It's more than that, though. It has this to be. This has the potential of becoming a political nightmare. Right. I'll look into what we've talked about tonight. I mean, Armstrong's pretty high you up in politics, too. Speak of this to no one. And huh. you, Elric brothers, behave yourselves. <laughs> I mean, how close is Armstrong to the pure? You were thinking about sneaking into this building and taking a look around, weren't you? We weren't. We weren't. We he weren't. knows them so well. <laughs> sure we weren't. Sure we weren't. Goes directly for it. Such goobers. A guard posted in an unused building. We could make our own entrance. They'd notice the light from the transmutic reaction. It's yeah. that bright. Oh, I guess it is pretty bright. <laughs> oh, it's that strong. I guess it's like prison quality. My goodness, though. And I guess the suit of armor is empty. They're not taking any chances, are they? Yeah, jeez. Whether I'm fine on my own or not isn't the issue. You're too big to get through here. Al can't help it. Dejected. Poor <laughs> Al. <laughs> what is it, 48? It looks as if we've got guests. Oh, shoot. <laughs> Some daredevil idiots came to visit, did they? Oh my gosh. They have like Sorry. number names. Yeah, I've got a small body. Oh no! I just got myself a tiny little bit He just <laughs> admitted it to himself. 66 and 48. Their lights on. What in the world? Not currently in use. Who are they trying to fool? The government's involved. 100 percent a long time. <gasps> oh shoot. Al knows. Oh my gosh, he looked so so creepy oh man we have quite the lead for next episode wait i want to see what he looked like again really quick i don't believe there's a post credits for this wait he looked mad creepy that mask though it looks kind of sick though so 66 and 48 i'm wondering if they're test experiments they have red eyes and we saw the red eyes from um from gluttony when he, was, he was in the sewer i don't know if that has any any relationship it might just be kind of like ominous in a way like an art style
out but my goodness we have quite the lead for next episode what is what is this that we found we found a new enemy aside from lust gluttony and whatever the other guy is that they were controlling that had power over the entire town so getting very interesting i hope you guys enjoyed be sure to comment down below your thoughts and i hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day peace peace